Rising the Sandman, Lisa Johnson and Robin Windsor. Thank you, my darling. Do you do the washing up in those gloves? <laughs> no, these are my gloves. Yeah, yeah. Oh, there you are, one. Sorry. Craig, start us off. Your shoulders were hunched almost all the way through that and raised up. You were sort of here. leaning a little bit too far forward from the top of your torso. It was very muddy and murky footwork. Oh. Uh, your thumb was sticking out like this. It'd be nice to tuck oh. that baby under. Well, we're getting very specific now. I mean, you know, yes, the, so the well. semi-finals are coming up. Semi-finals so I'm just are coming up. Help yes. you, darling. Oh. Uh, on a good note, the timing I thought was very, very good, and you have a gorgeous rhythm. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Now then, Len, stop looking at him. What I like, you come out every dance and you give it 100%. You don't hold back. You, you don't do it easy. I think that's admirable. It could have been a little sharper and crisper here and there. Sorry? It could have been a little sharper and crisper. However, I thought your thumbs were particularly attractive <laughs> tonight. So well done to you. You've got there to go. go. Especially in those gloves. How can you criticise those thumbs? Alicia. Bundles of energy and full of personality. You created a party atmosphere, Anita. Nobody can take that away from you. But in all honesty, I don't think you totally embodied that natural samba groove. And I do disagree with um, Craig. I think you did lose a little bit of timing. But having said that, your spirit and enthusiasm always carries you through the dance, and the crowd loves you. Yes. So, <laughs> they do. They do. And now, Anita, my darling, really. I love you because you really always work it and play it for all it's worth. But I think what happened is if there was so much fire up above, you forgot the fire down below. It, it means in the feet, you know what I mean? The samba requires such a sharp and precise execution. And at the same time, you have to create the party atmosphere. So to get the two together is very, very difficult. It's very, very hard. And you did well. But, you know, sometimes we all have dances that don't quite come out as we expect. Oh, a bit like that. Would you like to be my favourite? Yes, please. Well, be my favourite. <laughs> Thank oh, you. Please, yes. Well done, Robin. <laughs> Off you go. Over there. Go on. That's it. Thank you, Robin and Anita. It's such a long way. I thought you were going up the set, but never mind. Come on, Eileen. Come on, Anita, more like. <laughs> Let us into a little secret. What is it like performing it's, in front of that audience? It's fantastic. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Len said you give it 100% and you can't do much more than that. Now, we all saw how being the bottom two affected you last week. Yeah. Very emotional. 
You don't want a repeat performance of that, do you, Anita? No, and this was the hardest dance to do as well. The most difficult dance. Yeah. Well, we don't want a repeat performance of that, do we, Wembley? I don't think so. <laughs> scores are in. Ladies and gentlemen, the judges have their scores. Craig Revelhorn. Six. Len Goodman. Seven. Alicia Dixon. Seven. Bruno Tonioli. Seven.